Welcome back, folks. I have a problem. I have a big problem because it seems like... It's, uh, well, quite frankly, it seems like even though I have put crosswalks here, Rap Ancients can't cross this uh, two-way road. Uh, so none of the ramp agents here are arriving, which means none of the aircraft connected to to that to those stands are getting any service. So that's a bit of a problem. I also have a lot of people sitting down here. Uh, it seems like their favorite place to sit. Um, yeah. So I, I, I'm not sure how to fix this. I mean, we could make it a one-way road and just make sidewalk here, I guess. But but then what? And then we'd have all our vehicles going around this way and this way, which I guess is fine. So it's just in here, but, okay, so we'd have to turn this around. Okay, we can do that. All right, let's try it. It's going to be a little bit chaos uh, initially, but, okay, so one way, that way, that way, and that way actually I think I'd rather do it on the other side so that this goes in down and out now this can't be runway road then So it's basically just right here. Well, it can. It can be one-way road. Because it's basically just... Uh, I want to bulldoze these and these. All right, let's try that. And um, this bit of road here will be one way that way. Okay. Let's see if this will work. All right, uh, infrastructure, uh, sidewalk, like that, like that. Because over here, the, the ramp agents are getting to the service cars fine, but over here, no one ever shows up for a service car. Can we please get some sidewalk in here? What are you waiting for? Uh, come on, build the sidewalk for me. Oh, I know. Dummy. I didn't have to do all that. Uh, let's bulldoze that, bulldoze that, get the road back in there. I know exactly <laughs> what happened. Um, service road, concrete. I know exactly why they can't get over there right now. 
And it's because I'm an idiot. So we'll get this fixed. And I'll be right back. Right, it's all built. Let's see why they can't get there. There we go. Now they can. And ramp agents should be coming. Doesn't seem like it though. Let's just monitor and see if any ramp agents showed up. Uh, this is a staff room where, yeah, ramp agents are coming. Where janitor service uh, technicians and ramp agents are allowed to be. So fantastic. All right. This works now. So all of the aircraft will start leaving, which is good because they've been sitting there for a while. I am quite annoyed that people from upstairs come down, go through here and go around and out. I don't know how to fix that. It could be that we simply close this off so that this door is basically just for our ramp agents and we force people to go upstairs and through all the shops and down. I think that might be the idea. Let's do it. Uh, I don't want all those people walking there, so we'll build that there. Now over here I made some extra space and I did that um because i want a toilet and a shop in here i think so let's put toilets like that and then actually you know what let's not put that in. Oh, it's too late. Okay, then never mind. We'll do that. Okay, that'll be a shop. Now we need two toilets here, right? So, so we're going from there. So we'll put a uh, wall in here. Uh, medium doors, like that okay all right that wall is coming in uh let's see window and we get a nice window in here uh they built it and debuilt it fine uh zones secure zone that's secure. So I guess we'll just uh, build walls up to here. And we need bathroom here. We need bathroom here. We need some toilets. We put the ladies' room first. So there we will... I think we'll put a little wall in. Here. Just so people can't look straight into the stalls. And then we will put some sinks on this wall, and some hand dryers on this wall. Okay, that's the ladies' room. Let's see, how do we want to do this? I think a wall, maybe... Here, like that, 
We'll put toilet over here and urinals over here and sinks over here and some hand dryers over here. Alright, this is ladies and it is open. This is men and it is open. Alright. Now, for some reason, I need a crap ton of janitors. 607 jobs available for janitor janitors. I don't understand. Uh, applicants. Higher, 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 higher. I guess it is a big terminal, but that many? Uh, no, shops. Shop room. We'll make that a shop room. And we can get well, a lot of shops in here. Traveler's shop. Let's do that. Seven shelves. Okay. We can do that. A shop counter. It's this way, right? Yeah. Right here. Some nice shelves. Let's just copy that. No, let's go one down. Okay. Like that. And maybe some wall mounted shelves. Down here. Alrighty. Well, we have aircraft not airworthy. Okay, it's fine. That's fine. Where where is it? It's this one. Okay. Well, it'll go into the hangar and then everything will be okay. All right, so. Let's see, we have two airport shuttle buses here. I want one of them to switch. Don't care which one. Because I have over here, I have none. So, oh. So, let's see, is it this one? No, nope, it's the other one this one so reconnect airside shuttle bus so there so now each sta stand here is servicing one uh, aircraft stand which is what i want all right all of this down here is done so i am going To build a wall here. Um, actually, uh, I want security exits. Okay, so let's fix secure zone here. All of this isn't secure anymore. 
all of this isn't secure anymore. Uh, let's just say that all of this isn't secure anymore. And then we can get some security exits in. So I think we'll do one, three, four. Yeah. That'll work. Then we can do a uh, wall. This. We'll do it over there once these are built. Um, all of this is secure zone as well. Come on. And all of this is secure zone as well. But it is also staff zone. There. And there. Staff zone. Alright. Are these exits built? They are, it looks like. Good. Then we can do uh, terminal walls there. We can bulldoze this exit. We can remove the secure zone here. All right. Now, can I close some of these, is the question. Oh, I would like to have answered. No. Can I close some of these? No. Okay. I think we need some more check-in desks up here. I think we need some more chicken desks. So if we take a copy tool. Oh wait, I want all of this. Ooh. It might not like that. Yeah. It's fine. Uh, how many? One, two, three and a half. So one, two, three and a half. So there. All right, check-in desks are coming, and it's so nice with that copy tool. I actually think I might take four of them out. Uh, let's not build those. So that it's kind of a little island. Uh, let's not build those. And let's build a wall here. Okay. So that people can go around both ways. I think that'll be kind of nice. I think that'll be kind of nice. Uh, oh, we have two incidents now. Wow. Uh, well, that hanger is in use. That hanger will be in use, I guess. Maybe. Oh, well, that's this one.
All right, how are sales doing here? 830 sales. Jesus. This is closed. Let's find sales for bonus 140. Let's do Flygo. This one is closed. Let's do uh, Turner. Just 35 sales. Yeah, let's do Turner. Okay. So, what we were going to do today was baggage, wasn't it? So, I am going to be removing four of these. So we'll have a wall there. Which means I'll have a high speed escalator down uh, right around here. Let's do here and let's uh, demolish this wall, put a wall in there. Put a small door in here and here. Okay. Now, that comes down in the middle of nowhere. In the middle of nowhere. But what we can do is we can get the wall kind of going like this. Then we can demolish this wall here. This wall here needs to go. All of this needs to go. Uh, all of this needs to go. All of that needs to go, that needs to go, that needs to go. Okay. This needs to be secure zone. All right. And it needs to be staff zone. Uh, staff zone. In there. And then we need some baggage carousels or some baggage uh, bays. I think we'll put them right in the middle here. Uh, so one, one, let's do three in between each. And four. That's five of those in. Uh, so, can I just uh, mark this for demolish? Okay, it's active, so I can't. But once it's not active anymore, I can. Wanna demolish it? Come on, get that 
Check-in done. right now these guys are open three sales zero sales 69 sales 73 sales 78 sales it's insane the uh, uh, what's it called bistro bohem is doing insanely well you know what i think i'm gonna demolish these walls and make a nice large restaurant down here as well. Okay, let's see. This is done. Excellent. This is done. Uh, we don't really need those doors there. Uh, they're a bit weird. Uh, walls like that. Um... Staff zone, not like that, or like that, or that, or that, or like that. Okay, but this in here is staff zone. Okay, let's get some conveyors in. Uh, conveyor belts. Uh, no, I want high speed, right? High speed conveyor belt. Yeah. And it will run. Is that the right way? No. That's the right way. Uh like that and then we'll get all of this going in let's just do one side and then the other i hope they can go over these the employees so they're not stuck in there. I guess they can. Okay. High speed conveyor belts going in. Uh, let's repay our loan because there's absolutely no point in us having a loan right now. Oh, I already repaid it. Never mind. And we have 2.8 million. That is pretty good. Okay, so all of that is being built. Then... I mean, we need a service road to come in here and here. Right. Mm. So we're getting service roads. We will demolish the walls uh, where the service roads enter. I don't understand why that is not just done. I mean, the game should just do that, right?
Okay. Uh, let's go upstairs and get this baggage done over here as well. Uh, high speed escalator down. There. And then high speed conveyor. Like that. Boom. Boom. Oops. Saving. Okay. And we'll have all this baggage going. I think that is all good. Alright, those escalators are going in. And down here we need a wall. How big did I make it here? So we So we just need wall here. Here and here. We do not need one there. Then we need the baggage scanner. Uh, let's go into planning mode and try and plan out a baggage scanning system. Um, uh, then we have all of these. Uh, so one, two, Three, four, five, and then the scanning station here. And then the baggage destroyer down here, I guess. And then high speed conveyor belts. Like that. So this is all the, the bad stuff going this way, and all the good stuff will go this way. And come over here. So there, then it'll go down. Uh, high speed escalator down. Oh, do I need to put terminal under there? I might need to do that. Okay. Oh, there's something under there. Darn it. Uh, okay, but we can do it if we come up a little bit. So if we say high speed escalator up. Uh, I don't want it right there though.
Uh, I kind of want it at this height. So how about we put it there and we will uh, let's be conveyor belt demolish right, well, so we'll come up this way and then we'll come under and we'll come up I guess it would be right here. Uh, like that. Why didn't the other one go in? Oh, it's because I'm in planning mode. I'm not in planning mode anymore. Fine. Uh, it is in planning mode. So, here. Did I put in an up? High speed escalator down. Rotate there. Okay, now it's there. I put in an up, I guess. And here it's there. Alright. Oh, uh, what's this? Uh, GA flight. Okay, fine. Uh, planning. Uh, high speed conveyor belt. I won't be able to do this down here. This is bad. Okay, so it should come over and All right, so this is the departure stuff. So it should come down here and in. Okay, so that's fine. But, what about the arriving stuff? Uh, uh, crap, I hadn't so thought this through. I had not thought this through. I suppose we can use tilt trays and just have them share the belt. Yeah, why not? Uh, we'll come over, come down to here. And we'll do something like this. Um, and that's the last one, so we don't need that. And that can go in there. And then we'll do tilt trays. Uh, there, we actually don't need a tilt tray here. 
But we need tilt trays here. Okay, and then we need high speed conveyor belts here. Man, this baggage stuff is complex. Uh, so yeah, we do need a tilt tray here. There. Alright, because now, all the baggage, at least from this uh, guy here, once we get the high-speed conveyor belt in, and do that. Uh, this will come up here. Uh, it has to run under as well. All right, well, or we build another security thing here. You know what, that's what we're going to do. Uh, also, we need secure zone, staff zone, and then we need baggage, baggage scanner. here and then these guys one two three four five and the scanning station like that and a baggage destroyer which we'll just put here, I think. And then high speed conveyors. Ding. 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 And then this can simply come over here and come up and join that. Okay. Uh, high speed conveyor belt. Like that, like that. Okay. Uh, build planned objects. There. 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 And we need to go down under and the high speed conveyor belts going like that. And I do want uh, Terminal foundation like that. Okay, good, good, good. So, hopefully, all of that will be built. This has been built, and they can get to where they need to go, so that's good. Uh, we need to set up baggage claims as well, don't we? So that's actually what I was thinking that we do here. We're gonna move this staff room up here. And I think we'll put a staff security thing here. Uh, how, 
Uh, how big does that need to be? It's just a small checkpoint. So it's three wide. So we can put that right in the corner there. And then we can put a wall in. Something like that. A medium door here. And that'll be a staff room. Let's take a quick look at our funds. So we made 401,000 yesterday, but well, we, we lost 2,000, but that's because we were building. Um, so we are, we are doing very well. Uh, let's check. Uh, so incident report, 100% good. Uh, yeah, I know we can do contract ne negotiations. But I don't want to do that right now. Total income 1. almost 2 million. Aircraft infrastructure fees 782,000. Construction 390,000. So excluding constructions 401, yeah. So a total of 170. Aircraft processed, 131 small, 39 large, uh, medium. That's because we have the GA as well. Uh, average airline rating 77%. That isn't great. I would like to get that up. Passengers processed 7,711. 2,258 franchise purchases made. Not bad. Not bad. Um... I want to see economy uh, franchises. So yesterday we made around 75,000 off franchises. That's not bad. That's not bad. Okay, from parking as well. But it's obviously the aircraft that are is making us the most money. Right, this is built. I think we'll have to do uh, a baggage pickup area in the next one because we are out of time. But we're getting there. We are getting there which I am very happy about. We will put baggage claims here and we'll have some carousels. Yeah. I think that'll be good. And uh, we will, I'll move this wall down uh, some like down to here or something because then we can have uh, this coming out through the wall and directly onto the belt without us having to go underneath and all kinds of things so i think this will work i think this will work and we have a security officer sitting here good good People are in a rush to get out. And how are our shops doing? Uh, well, they're closed right now. Four sales. But they're still here. And they're not complaining yet. What's this about? What? An employee can't find a staff room. Make sure that staff room is accessible through walls and zones. Uh, it is. Ah, uh, he'll fix himself. Now, why is the zone overlay on? I do not like that. 
All right, people are starting. Whoa, look at that. Ew. Uh, we need to turn this counter around. <laughs> okay. Uh, sales here, 95 of 140, 49 of 35, so these are actually selling. Is that magazines? It looks like magazines or something, yeah. And what's it down here? Some fruit, some knickknacks, headsets. Mm, okay. All right, so next time we'll finish up the baggage. We'll open up baggage uh, for the airlines and we'll set up a restaurant here, I think. That's going to be the plan. So yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.